Next, we're going to queer up politics. George Santos defends J.D. Vance's cross-dressing, saying, it's definitely not drag. Disgraced former Congressman George Santos has re-entered the political arena, offering his thoughts on Senator J.D. Vance amid revelations about Vance's past. Photos recently surfaced showing Vance dressed as a woman at a Yale Law School party, igniting debate among hard-right Republicans. In an interview with TMZ, Santos dismissed the controversy as disingenuous, arguing that, quote, most dudes at some point have played around, end quote, with cross-dressing. He added, quote, couples do that all the time. The wife will dress up as a guy, the husband will dress up as a woman, so it's not drag, it's definitely not drag, end quote. The photos, shared by a former Yale classmate, show Vance posing seductively in a blonde wig, black blouse, colorful skirt, and chunky necklace. Santos has faced his own drag-related scandal. Santos's drag persona, Kitara Rivash, came to light in 2023. Initially denying the allegations, Santos later admitted to his alter ego, even reviving Katara for paid cameo appearances. Vance, on the other hand, has consistently op opposed LGBTQ rights, has introduced legislation to ban gender-affirming care for transgender youth, and has supported the Don't Say Gay legislation. So George Santos is the herpes sore that no matter how much Veltrex you imbibe, he just keeps popping up uglier than before. Listen, Georgie, when we want shit, we'll squeeze your head. Until that time, just shut the fuck up. You know, I look at it and say, just because he put a dress on and a wig on doesn't make it drag. I'm sorry, our 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 drag individuals are entertainers. The taste level they, is just the, yeah. The taste zero. level is way above. I mean, chunky necklace. No, <laughs> um, so that's all I have to say.